Well, hello, friends. I bet you wonder what I've been doing with my day today. I am out early Friday doing my yard work because it's been a little chilly for me in the evenings. <laughs> yeah, every time I turn the camera on, somebody has an emergency. Sounds like they went past the house. <laughs> I, guess, I guess the front of my house isn't on fire. Friends, today I am going to take part in an open collaboration called Hashtag Let's Share Our Plant Success and Disaster Stories. This open collaboration is hosted by our good friend Janita, and her channel is Janita's BF Well Wishes Gardening. If you don't know this channel, you need to go over and check it out. I have a lot going on in my garden. We are going to start out looking at some things that the um, nightly visitor who is working the night shift has been digging in. Well, I think we're going to have a potato day. So come on, friends, let's get to this. Looks like something has been harvesting my potatoes. I guess if I'm going to get any, I had better check and see what I ha if I have anything left in the bags. This one's completely gone. The plant is even missing. I don't think they're even ready to be harvested yet. Look at that. Well, let's dump these out and let's see if we've got a disaster or if we have a harvest. Bag number two grass growing at the bottom. I think this one's going to be a two-handed job. Let's see if anything was left for me. I really doubt if there was, if it looked like whatever it was really had experience in how to do this. Oops, sorry, that's my little shovel. Don't do this end. Get some of this out. Make sure we don't have anything in there. Look at that little baby potato. That's ridiculous. <laughs> uh, we're going to hold on to it though. A rock right there. Look, had an onion growing in there. Nobody wanted that. weeds from the bottom. Oh, look, there's another really small one. Wow. Finish up my chore.
I don't think we got anything else in here. I think whatever was in the bag did a real good job. The only thing it left was stuff that was too small. animals are good at harvesting. A little onion that's not ready and two small potatoes. Hold on. I got one that was left. Uh, where is it? So that's all that was left for me. Somebody's not sharing fairly. <laughs> I put the soil back in the pots and look, here's another one of those little potatoes. <laughs> My harvest is growing. Well, friends, before I go, I want to tell you a little story. It's a potato story. It's how I started growing potatoes. When I first started gardening and making videos, you know, I know some things about gardening and some things I don't. But my goal was to grow a rose bush from cutting. And I had run across the video of someone who took a potato and stuck a rose cutting in there. And so that's what I was trying. Well, to tell you the truth, my rose cutting died and I decided I needed that pot again. And when I emptied it out, I had potatoes. Yeah, I said, oh, potatoes. And it turns out that wherever I stick a potato, potatoes do very good in my garden. And they taste good too. <laughs> yeah, I'm just hoping I'll be able to get my dream of having a pot of potatoes ready every month next summer. I'm gonna try to figure out a way to secure my potato pots and also maybe put some potatoes around as distractions. Something that'll be easy to get to that they can actually I don't mind if you have that one. So what do you think about that plan? Do you think the distraction potatoes is a good idea? Let me know in the comments, okay? Well, friends, that's all I have for today. I want to thank Janita for hosting this very fun, open collaboration. So anyway, friends, yeah, it's time for me to say bye. So I guess... <laughs> So if it's time for me to say it, I just might as well do it, right? Sorry about the, the sun coming through here. I'm doing this earlier in the day. So, bye-bye, uh, friends. Bye. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>